What's up, everybody? <clears throat> and I kind of slacked off. 1.6 is now out, and I am trying to finish this up so I can switch over to it. But I'm having a little difficulty. Uh, I was busy trying to figure out busy trying to figure out the track system here. Uh, again, I want to stress this uh, so I can make this very, very clear. Um, this setup, this uh, this is not my my idea. I'm simply taking this idea and stretching it a little bit to fit what I need to fit. Now, I really haven't done anything except take all the hoppers out, take all the chests out, get everything done, and I was busy trying to lay down track to figure out how I wanted this to work. And I ran into a slight problem. I don't know if the minecarts are going to be an issue as far as touching each other. Um, I don't think they will, but I want to make sure, so, uh, ah, crap, that's right, I got too close. Get off of that. I don't want you on that. If I wanted you there, I would put you there. Gosh dang it. So actually, we got to get ourselves another minecart. This is what I'm afraid of, is I'm going to have to rework the... Uh, rework this somehow, some way. I really, really, really hope this does not affect. Which I think it's going to. I think it's going to affect it. I honestly think it is. I can't put... Oh, shit. Oh, well. Okay, that goes there. That like that. Here, get on there. Oh, you're not even on the track. So we're having difficulties. Get on the track. No, don't go down. Whew. Okay. And you come off. Okay. You come off. This is probably I've been having. Figure this crap out. I'm tearing up my tracks. I really didn't want to. But it's well worth it. As soon as we can figure out what the strategy is here. That there and that there, like that. Let's get another minecart, just somewhere in here. By the way, all of this stuff is dropping off of mobs from my mob farm, which is pretty cool, except the cart here. Okay, now, if this is right, in the old Minecraft version, carts had to be one block apart from each other. Yep. Shit. Well, I should have known that was going to happen. Alright, so we got to come up with a new strategy for this. Because this is going to be a little bit different than what I was expecting. I thought this would be fixed. And I thought I could have it fixed. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Let's put all this back. Don't want to lose it. Where's my carts? Hello, carts. Did I just not pick them up? I just did not pick them up. Okay. Oh, uh, let's put the redstone back. Put that back. Okay. So. I have figured out how he did his automatic system. And I have to make, make com more com compactors. Not a big deal there. And I watched a couple of his videos. And again, like I stress, I want to make sure everybody understands this is not my design. Uh, I picked this up from Daedalus822. Please go look at his YouTube page. He's a really great builder, and I really do like his ideas. Whoa. Good God. What a hole. Let's fill this up. Oh, my luck, I'd fall in it and die. Um, so. And we have to, and the carts are going to touch every angle. I was hoping I wouldn't have to do this. But I may have to switch it out and I may have to change Oh yeah, I want to I should show you this too. Uh, dang. It's disappointing. Very disappointing. I moved all this all these uh, I just did this a few minutes ago. But I moved all of my uh, cobblestone and my ore uh, chests from back here. Um I was testing around to see if I could use, but uh, this is my strip mine. 
or my mine area. Uh, this is why it was so important for me to get to the nether as quick as I could to get the uh, glowstone. And oof. Let me tell you, there's a ravine right above us. I died. A lot. And I actually stopped right here. And I haven't actually gotten up there yet because I know the ravine's there. But I also know one of these places runs into... Is it up top? It's up top. Well, anyways, I'm not going to waste time. Uh, one of these places runs into a mine shaft, so that should be interesting. Uh, I did use a heck of a lot of glass uh, before I actually went and got glass, so, yeah. But, uh, so yeah, I originally had this all hidden behind a piston door. Uh, that's, and the, it was way up there, the glass, so that I couldn't, no, uh, no monsters could come in. But, uh, I decided to go ahead and switch it out. Put the glowstone in, make it look a little bit, you know, pretty, or pretty. Uh, we are sitting at bedrock level, which is somewhere here. There we go, see? Bedrock level. So we are sitting at bedrock level, so hopefully nothing can spawn. Uh, from my understanding, this in this area, nothing, no, bedrock level, nothing does spawn. So, I missed some redstone, damn it. Uh... Anyways, so it's kind of bad because I really wanted to make one system to where I had train the the carts going this way, and my enchanting room is over there, and life would be easier. You know what is the brightness on this thing? Video, it's bright. Okay, just because I'm down below. What if we did this? Because I know everybody's like, I can't see shit. Turn off decreased particles. Will it help? No. Oh well. But do expect this at bedrock level, okay? Um, and I like bedrock level because, uh, as you saw, my mine shafting uh, can do multiple things. I haven't really touched over here yet. I really should. I mean, getting off subject here. This is a problem. Um, God, I just gonna have to move all this shit is really gonna be hard unless I use one but if I see I don't want to use one because I'm telling you you can dump I dump a lot of cobblestone I mean here I just get this is filled this is full this has got some lupus in it that's got some ore in it that's full of copper I mean of, of Cobblestone, 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 cobblestone. I mean, the only thing I actually really separated out was the gravel, the dirt, of course the coal, and all this beautiful ore, which is from the Simple Ores mod. It, well, the stuff that's not iron, gold, redstone, lupus, or diamond. But I'm off subject again. Sorry. So if I eat... I would have to split them, so one would have to go on one side, one would have to go on the other. Which means this one track would have to run like this, going up this way, tearing the hell up out of my stairs, run through this way, and it would just have to keep running this way. Hmm. Then it would come up, and I saw the iron. I just haven't had time to get to it. And then I could bridge it can I put a cart would a cart fit through there yeah a cart would fit through there right could I fit through there no I couldn't fit through there but I wouldn't have to worry about fitting there I could no shut up cow run the run it this way because that's my separator right there then run it on this block then come around Hmm. I have to come around around here. Go in here. Which means we have to have a doorway here. And then one hopper would have one cart would have to go there. 
No, we can't do that neither. Damn it. Do I really? I, I, you know what? I'm just going to do one. This is too complicated. This is too complicated for me right now. And yeah. Anyways. So uh, if you have not watched Dallas 822's uh, uh, video, I would suggest you do because obviously I can't pay, cannot do good good well for this man. Uh, he did he did an excellent job uh, showing showcasing how he was going to do this, uh, but I'll try my best here. So you're going to need a compactor. Well, first of all, we need. We need hoppers. Let's get a hopper. Okay. So, let's say this is the train track right here. Okay. You're going to put down the block. Okay. And, of course, you would put uh, say the say this is where the train the tracks would start to end. So, we would need to put shit. I'm so glitchy about this. I really hate explaining it in my world, but it's. I'd rather show you by example. So, okay. So I need to get this right here. So we need to. Nope, that's going to point that down. I don't want to point it down. I need to point it back. So if I put a block here and I attach it like this, yeah, that'll work. So okay, so let's say that this is the where the hopper connects, and then of course you down hold down shift and then click. So what you would do is you would put a compactor, right? Shit, wrong way. Come on, don't do this. You put a compactor facing facing away and then a block here with a redstone torch on top and then you'd put another block on top of the compactor like that okay and redstone and come here give me that where do you go Give me that. Just resources are too precious. Put that there. And we'll just run another one here, like this. Okay, and then we get. Okay. So. I think that's right. We throw, throw something in the hopper. Well, that was supposed to work. What did I do wrong? Or wait, 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 wait. Is that manually powered? I think that's supposed to be powered. Okay. Give me that, give me that, okay. Where is the regular tracks? There they are. I'll get it out in a minute, guys. I'm sorry. It's taking forever. I'm tired. I want to go to bed. I want to sleep. Sleep, sleep, sleep. But I was googling, not googling. I was goofing around here, trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing, which I don't really know what I'm doing half the time, anyways. You haven't figured that out. Uh, that trap chest. I don't want a trap chest. I want a regular chest. There we go. Uh, trying to make sure I got this damn thing right. I'll put gravel in there. Okay, if it should power. Okay. That's supposed to. It's got the gravel in it already. No, it should be powering off. What the hell did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? What have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? I'm missing a block, I think. I'm trying to think here. Did I miss a block? I think I missed a block. Did I miss a block? Yeah, was I supposed to put a block right here? Aha! That's what it was. Okay. Told you I'd figure it. I get it. I'll get it figured out one way or another. Okay, so now. 
we'll put that in there, okay? It's in the chest. And then the chest will get roll up in there. All the loot will drop. And it'll push back down, just like that. So for that, I'm going to need one, two, three. One, one compactor, one redstone, one, two, three blocks. Okay. So, yeah, that's how it's supposed to work. And then the hoppers will transport it to the filters, which will be here. And I'm probably going to do a lot of this off camera, to be honest with you, because this is a lot of work. And I know a lot, a lot of people want to watch this. And I know a lot of people have already watched Dado's uh, Let's Play. If you haven't, I would suggest you do. It's a really good series. Um, he does break down a lot of different things. He does make it a little bit easier to try out. And he does have a, a data saved world. Uh, which hopefully, you know, you, if you've seen some of my videos, you've seen I've actually downloaded his world. So I could see how his red machines work. Because uh, I, I love dissecting apart people's stuff and figuring out how exactly they could come up with it. And uh, his wasn't because he just, you know, got tired of running back and forth, like I do. Uh, tired of running back and forth in the mine, his mine. So we do know that we're going to need a hell of a lot more space than what we've got here. So what may wind up happening is I may wind up having to extend this out, getting rid of this door and putting in in here using this doorway which I really didn't want to in the beginning but I may have to yeah I may have to do that then again I could I could possibly come from the top it's a possibility come from the top somewhere come over here somewhere you know and just have this last section staircase down and then be in the storage room crap I missed a shibble tons of coal here I'm getting bad about that finding coal and not picking it need every bit I can get my hands on uh... so 1.60 is out and this video will probably be far behind where it should be uh, just because I'm a loser and I just haven't had time to up to uh, t t uh, to get stuff loaded up to YouTube because um, I'm just being lazy I guess uh, but the way I figured it as I had room for uh, what was it how'd it go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 5, 26. So I got room for 26 items. And cobblestone, I'm actually going to have set up somehow, some some way else, somewhere, somehow else. Uh, just because cobble, there's going to be a ton of cobblestone, and I'm getting hungry in real life in Minecraft. Uh, I want cobblestone to be. I want. I want to be able to store double the amount of cobblestone, um, and that's gonna be really hard to do. Uh, but I think I can do it. So cobblestone won't be here. It'll be in another section. Um, but I need the hop. I need to get the hoppers down straight first. I can. I got. I figured out how the hopper system works. Pretty damn good. And now it's just getting it all set up to where it runs functionally and I don't want anything to I want to hide a lot of stuff here so I may have to take out all this glowstone and uh, make it just one pathway one walkway that's what we're probably going to wind up doing um, what else what else that's pretty much it uh, I did get another villager There's, as you see there's four dots there so I did I have been letting them out to stretch their legs I just haven't had time to actually go up there and say hey guys what's up uh, the other little green dot that's spazzing out over there is a bat down at our level um, what else what else what else that's pretty much it I'm sorry I'm not very talkative and I don't have any really big projects but this one's gonna take a lot of time and energy 
and I have to, you know, go through here and take out power rails and all kinds of stuff. Get get myself reorganized. Oh, 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 oh. this is another thing. Um, with 1.6, we're going to have horses, right? So, uh, oh, we still got to do the pasture too and the barn. Still so much more work to do. Um, let me get back up this way. I promise you I, w I will stop ranting here shortly and go to work. I just want to show this first. Uh, the pasture for the horses and donkeys. I will have to go out and find them, of course. In 1.6, they just don't automatically magically appear in your area. You have to go find them, I think, in plain area, something like that. It's a biome you have to be in to find it. Oh boy, come on, come on. Up, 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 Such a long staircase. Oh, I finally got the sheeps. No, I didn't get the sheeps out of here. Son of a gun. Uh, so, the barn. And the horses. I'm actually thinking about taking the horses and making them part of the barn area, part of the pasture area. Uh,. However, I want to give them their own little section because I plan on making a cow pen, a chicken pen, and a pig pen, and a sheep pen. Actually, I plan on making a chicken coop, to be honest with you. And I did a chicken coop in one of my worlds, which was pretty cool. Uh, I just have to go back and research it. Um, however, we're getting to the point where... What the hell? Come on, Minecraft, load. I can see inside everything. And that's not... That's cheating. Um, I really want to start building, kind of per se, uh, the, the making the, the city a little bit bigger. Anyways, this is what I wanted to show you. Um, this area I designated for the pasture area. But what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to build in the middle a small barn area, okay? And then from that small barn area, I'm going to extend off half the pat, you know, four corners of the pasture. So you have pigs, sheep, cows, and chicken coop. And, oh, sorry. And I'll have it where there'll be a doorway, of course, here, where you can come out. And then there'll also be a doorway where you can leave and go out that way. But my biggest project, and this is the one that's going to take me a little while to figure out, because I have such such a, amount of, a large amount of cobblestone, is going to be the hardest one for me. I actually want to build the farm over the water area. So, kind of per se, maybe put another door here, perhaps, and have it running out. And then over the water, uh, probably extending it up a little into the sky. Um, I will tell you this, I did take the greenhouse and I did turn it into a garden area so I can start growing wheat. And uh, it's working out pretty well, I have to say, I was impressed. But again, last again, that's not what it was meant for, but oh well times change plans change so anyways uh, I'm gonna quit my rambling and I'm gonna go to work in getting the storage room built uh, the hopper system the mat as data, data called it the massive automatic item sorter and what else what else oh uh, uh, stress again I don't take credit for this uh, I just like I didn't take credit for the automatic furnace uh, I just I just want to tweak it a little bit, change it, and not make it mine per se, but make it so that it's a little bit more uh, lease or lease. It's a little bit less. Uh, what's the word? What's the word? Um, I'll get it out in a minute. It's less um, resource. It's more resource friendly. There we go. Uh, because a lot of people who you know, like for example, me for example. I may have this, and I may have this, and I may have that, and I may have, hmm, I must have been using my diamond pickaxe for that one. Uh, I may have the diamonds, but those can be eaten up really quickly. 
uh, resource wise and these bad, bad boys here take a lot of gold so yeah I've got to be careful uh, you know especially like the tree farm for example you know using half slabs that takes a lot of resources to do that a lot of wood so you know gotta be careful about that but I want to I'm trying to change the things and make them more resource friendly if that's the best way to say it yeah so anyways thanks for watching and listening to my rambling um, I'm hoping to get things neat and organized before I actually update to 1.6 uh, that way if there's any problems or anything that comes up I will be able to see it instantly and be able to tell you so you know what I know and the world will be a better place anyways thanks for watching oh oh, oh check this out where's the, where's it at which one is it it's uh one of the last ones I was doing. Where is the hell's it at? I have to stop because of of uh because I run into lava. So if you're looking at Rin's mini map over to the right hand top side, okay. This actually connects me to another continent. Okay. So I'm going to another continent right now. I'm sitting in another continent, which is pretty awesome. But if you keep running, okay. Ooh, was that redstone I missed? Damn, I missed redstone. Um, and you hit lava. Now, I'm not brave enough to go over it. But there is uh, this other section. It was uh, kind of empty. And uh, you kind of see this. And it just keeps going. I mean, I'm endless. It's endless until you hit lava again. And... Like I said, I'm not too brave to try this and to go through this because I know damn well I'll burn. And 90% of the time I have a ton of cobblestone on me. If you're wondering how the, why the glowstone is so predominant, it's because I really don't like torches. I like the glowstone effect. And I like how organized it looks. And plus, including when you're running. Look at that. Look at that. La la. I got lucky on this one. I died on this one. I got lucky on that one. I missed a spot. No, I didn't. That's outside the glass. Anyways. So thanks for watching. And I will see you again next time. And again, sorry for the little mallowness. It's just, I'm really sad because I really wanted this system to work the way I had it set up in my head. And it's, sorry, scratch my head. And, um, it's not going to work. So it sucks. Anyways, appreciate it, guys. As always, like, subscribe, make your comments. Love me, hate me. I don't care. I love you anyways. All right, bye.